So is Carlin Austin just not campaigning at all? Not saying a word to anybody, which blows my mind. Like, why would they even do that? That's super sketch. Like, nothing. Not a word. There's just no way both of them come off a block, though, with a secret power. You know what I mean? I mean, he's not saying anything. He said he's not campaigning, he's not going to blow up people's games, he's not going to say nothing. Well, he's trying to blow up Ty and Jed's game. Because they were talking to V about not trusting them. They told Vic that it was Ty and Jed who told them to pitch Vic to me. Mm. That's what they told Vic, which is a lie because they never said that to me. Mm. You know what I mean? Because mm. I know yesterday he wanted to say stuff, but then after yesterday afternoon, the evening, he just, he's not saying anything else. So I don't know. Interesting move. But you'd think, though, if you were on the block, if you really wanted to stay here, you'd campaign. At least speak your case. Mm hmm. Exactly. Saying so you want to be here. This is my turn? Yeah. Yes. Okay, so. Um, yeah, so I don't know what's on the ground. But... I have no idea. It just doesn't make sense. No, it makes no sense whatsoever. They're just hanging out with each other. Non-stop. I didn't go in there and talk to I just don't understand. Nothing is making sense anymore. Do you think that it's possible that there's a secret power? Even if there is, there's no way both of them are safe. No. Because I'm... I'm honestly... I honestly think it's better for my game if Austin leaves. I... To be quite honest with you, I agree. Like... She would probably put me up. I don't think Kyle puts me up. I think he goes after Ty and Jed. I think that's that's what would happen. <sighs> but I can't trust Kyle at all. But everybody knows you can't trust Kyle. Mm -hmm. Everybody knows where Austin is. I think Kyle everybody is. knows Austin. Nobody knows where Austin is. That's, that's Austin was there. telling um, people that I was telling her <laughs> I hate starting out sentences like that. That I told her that Jed and Beth threw the competition to Rohan. I never had that talk with Austin. No, you didn't. No. And she's telling people that I said that to her. But that's bullshit. Yeah, I know. I never said that to her. I also never said that Ty and Jed had the deciding. No. I, that came out of thin air. So there's two things that Austin has said that has come out of thin air about me. I'm very careful with my words, Steve. Oh, I know you are. I know Very you are. careful. I know you are. Very calculated, very careful. Exactly. Last week they were calling, or two days ago they were calling me an idiot, and now they're calling me a mastermind. Right, like, you know. At least they're recognizing what oh, I'm yeah, doing. Oh, yeah, for sure. Or at least they're recognizing the move. But the, the question is, do you still want Kyle to be the one to go home? I do. I don't want to shoot and miss on a big target like that. And I just don't... F but, everyone. but is Austin becoming a big target? She is. She's a huge target. We already know where Kyle's game is at. Exactly. I think Austin... If she doesn't go home next week... Oh, God, we're fucked. Vic's going to go for her. Like... 
Vic's playing a really smart game right now with them. With who? Austin and Braden. By not blowing up on them. It is much harder. Yeah. So I keep it's hard for me to concentrate on both. <laughs> I know. Oh, I know. So, are you kind of leaning more towards the call thing right now? Because you think that that's what the guys. guys no. I just think that. And part of me, I did tell Austin she wouldn't go home during my HOH. But would would she keep the same same for you? No, not a chance. You do have to remember, look, I'm I'm good with whatever decision that you you decide on, um, you know. But just do keep it in the back of your head that you are here to play your game. I know. And whatever's going to get you further. I just, I think that this move in the end will benefit me. You mean Kyle or Austin? Kyle. Getting Kyle will benefit me in the long run. I really feel that. Him and Ryan are too dangerous. Together. Yeah, they are, but... They're, they're tran their game is transparent right now. Everybody knows how they're playing the game. Same with, I think, same with Austin. People are really realizing what a target she is. Like well, she's just saying everybody's but the name problem, right now. The problem is with Austin is that you, you don't know who her targets would be. Honestly, you have no idea who her targets would be. I, I really think it's Ty and Jed. Why wouldn't it be? I just doesn't, I just, I don't think that they'd want to take a big shot. That's just my view on her, but I don't know if she, she would be, I think, I think she wants somebody else to take that shot. I don't know, I just have like a gut feeling. I just feel like it's just a bad idea to switch it up. I mean, obviously you gotta weigh out all the pros and cons of everything, and I respect what, you know, what you feel is, is best for your game. Um, you know, just as but you do have to weigh out all options. Yeah. Right? I just think. Everyone's so convinced she's a very strong competitor, but I'm just not sold on that fact yet. These games have all been chance. Like the last two were chance. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, if you, Tara, Vic, Ty, Jed, or Beth win, like, there's 0% chance I see the block, mm. I think. Oh, definitely. And that's what I'm gambling on. And I just concerns think, me with Austin, though. But I think we're we're not giving her enough credit. I think she knows. Vic profusely told me, and I believe her, that Austin wanted her to backdoor Todd. Hmm. Do you think Austin would have wanted that last week? No. Really? No. I just don't think she would do a big move. Because right now, she's... She's well perceived by everyone in the house. In I don't think she's well perceived. Not well perceived, but she's she doesn't have any enemies, so to speak, in the house. Just me. Right? Like she's you know, she's hanging out a lot more with Jed Ty. But they don't trust her at all. They want Oh no, I no, I get that. They yeah. want her gone now. You know you'd get the votes. Yeah, it's a lot to think about. But again, you know, you know, there's, there is two sides because, you know, if you eliminate Kyle, then you're eliminating the connection between Rowan and Kyle and Austin and Kyle. So exactly. you're, you're splitting that up. If you eliminate Austin, then you still have Rowan and Kyle, but you know the game they're playing. Um, you don't know the game that Austin's playing in terms of who she'd actually go after, right? And the guys will probably start taking shots at the guys. 
So it's like you're damned if you do and damned, damned if you don't because it's it's essentially I don't know where they fuck they were. I don't know where they it's your move. Oh, is it? Sorry. Yeah, no, damned if I do, damned if I don't. Like, you know what I mean? I, th I think there's positives and benefits of both. And like, you know that I'm still, it like, I mean, I still view you as like a sunsetter, you know what I mean? Mm. And I appreciate that, I do. I don't know how the guys feel about it, but you know, I'm they trying, feel, I'm uh, trying I'm to. I'm being honest with you teens, they feel really good. They okay. think that you're doing a great job and they like, of course they were cheesed because, or whatever, yeah. but. I'm telling you, they want to go for Austin and Braden bad, mm. bad. Those are, they're, they're dangerous But that's players. after Kyle. Yeah, so they want Kyle first? Yes. Okay. There's definitely discussions happening just because of how comfortable she is and how comfortable she is lying to people's faces. Very. Because Vic profusely told them that Austin was like saying they needed to take out Ty last week. Mm. And I just don't know what to believe anymore. Because how much can I trust Vic? Yeah, uh, you know, I, I do think Vic is more partial to Jed and Ty than she is with Ro and Kyle. 100%. She hates Ro and Kyle right yeah. now. Yeah. Hates them. Yeah. They, she said that they promised her loyalty, that they wouldn't say her name this week. And that was the first thing that they did. Yeah, that went out the door pretty damn quick. Very quickly. Yeah. And I don't even, I don't know where the story originated from in terms of where all that went down. Um, it was trickled down to me, so I don't know, like you say, I don't know if Ro and Kyle were the source of that. Or because there was a conversation where um, I think Braden had with Jed at one point too. And I don't know if that was the first conversation right after that competition or if mm -hmm. it... I have no idea. Things are just getting messy. I just hate that I'm in the middle of it all. I know, and the worst part about it is, is I think no matter how many weeks go by now, we're all going to feel like we're in the middle of everything. Yeah. There's less people to be involved every week. And the next person to, after this, the next person to go home is the last person who's not going to be in Jerry. So we're all stuck with each other for 70 days. So if I go home next week, it's not the worst thing in the world. I don't well, want, I want to. to. And I don't want you to go home. I don't. Save me over everyone. <laughs> don't you worry. Yeah. Fuck. You won't be going home on my watch. That's good. Not if I can do anything about it, that's for sure. Yeah. You're a terror. Exactly. Yeah, it's just like you say, what to do. Like, you know, if, like I said, if you're, if you're set on Kyle, then, then that's what it'll do. I just don't want to shoot and miss do. because I, I don't know if he will cut a deal with Ty and Jed. You know what I mean? I still think in my gut. Me too. Despise what the guys are saying about each other. I still think it's all an act. I think there's a bit of an act for sure. That's why I want Kyle gone. That act is over. Part of it anyways. Yeah. But if like the whole house has those three targets, like that's pretty good. I mean, you, you can put, I'm not gonna, I'll support whatever you wanna do as HOH, if it's one from each side, it doesn't matter to me. Yeah. Basically, as long as it ain't me. And it won't be. And you don't need another tell me names. I don't care. I trust your decision making. No, it's. Um, I wonder if the conversations are going to start ramping up, or if people are just going to let it. Let they're it go ramping up. up. You think they're ramping up? For sure. Because people like from the conversation I had out there with Ty, Jed, Beth, and Spice. Every one of them thought Austin was more dangerous than Kyle. Mm -hmm. But one of the conversation subjects was if you like 
were to win HOH, I don't think you would put up Kyle or Ro. Who? You. Me? Yeah. I wouldn't be too sure of that. Because they, it's per, you're perceived to have a really good relationship with both of them. I have fun with them. I know. That's <laughs> that's what I said. I said I don't know. I was like, teens might surprise everybody. You know what I mean? Yep. But they're not. They're not going to bet their game. And I get that. I get that, that you would do. You know what I mean? I get it. In their eyes, it would be more likely for you to go after Austin and Braden mm. because this doesn't leave this room. I swear. But Braden has said if he won HOH, it would be you and Tara. I know. That he I've heard that already. Okay. I just heard that out there from Beth. Mm. But again, that could be a lie too mm. because they know Beth is working with the guys. Yeah. I don't know why Beth thinks nobody knows that. Doesn't make sense. I'm just like, Beth, they know. They, uh, we, they definitely know. They're feeding you information. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. But it could be, I mean, even to just say that to somebody you don't trust mm. is a, a tell. Because I really don't see Brayden making a giant move. No. He would go with a safe move, and that's why I think Austin would do a safe move. And that's why I think with the, if either of them won it, myself and Tara would go up. Guaranteed. You think they would, you don't think that it would be me and Tara or me and Vic? No. You, I think Austin would put me up, teens. You don't I don't think, think so. so. I think they'd do an easy move. Easy move to them in their eyes. And it would be me and Tara. So, regardless, they can't win at all. Best case scenario in that you and Tara. And I, I don't, and I don't think Kyle or Ro. Well, I don't know about Ro, but I don't think Kyle would put me and Tara up just yet. I think Austin and Braden would if they had the opportunity. Hmm. I think it's your move. Oh, is it? 